guys it's Shani and I'm here today as you'll see below with a review for the January Her Fashion Box. If you um, are unfamiliar with Her Fashion Box it's a, it's not new anymore but it's a fairly early on um, subscription service that's based for Australia, mix of fashion and beauty. Uh, it is the first fashion beauty box in Australia so that's pretty cool. Uh, I've been a member of them for a while, um, you can go online you pay $40 a month I want to say and you get a choice of three boxes, a classic box, a feminine box, or a trendy box. Obviously they go along with the styles, classics, so a lot of classic products, feminines, girly stuff, and the trendy box is a lot of brights and things like that. I subscribe to the trendy box, it comes all packaged like this, and they each have their own sort of individual um, tissue paper as well. I get this really cool leopard print. All the links to her fashion box will be um, down in the description bar as well as all the links to my social media. Um, when you open the box, you do get this little magazine which I will be referring to. So if I'm looking down, that's what I'm looking at. And we'll get started. So this is a little bit of a fashion magazine as well as giving you prices and some more information about the products that you get in your box. And it, um, the really cool thing about her fashion box as well is you can change your box. So if one month you got a trendy box and you really didn't like it, but it does show you what each of the other um, boxes get you can change your box as well and it's no charge it's just that month you get that box and the next month you can change it again if you like the first product you got here is worth eight dollars and this is this little nail care kit so you know tweezers little travel care kit this is a her fashion box exclusive from what i can make out and um, this is worth eight dollars the next thing this is an exclusive product this is a can tasky swimwear um notebook you can see it's got like their logo on it. You open it up, it's a little bit, and it's just blank pages. So you can fill with whatever you want, and it's got that really nice sort of gold leafing effect on the paper there. That's worth $20. So you've already made half the value of your box in just those items there. Okay, getting on. So we got this pretty cool looking scarf. This is called the 2D Free. If you look there, it's got this really funky print. This is worth $25. I'm not a huge scarf person, so I probably wouldn't pay $25 for it. And for me personally, it's a little bit too big. I would have preferred to be smaller so I could wear it in my hair or something like that. But you know, everyone is different taste. My sister loves scarves, so I'm not a huge scarf person. The next thing is this zest necklace. So you can see it's sort of that clear plastic, this yellow, bright yellow and sort of pewter um, hardware on it. This is worth $25 as well. Um, this is a very unique piece. You obviously wouldn't be able to wear it with everything, but if you had a, I think a nice black top or something, it would look really um, attractive, or they've worn it here with this really cool sort of red print. Kingy top thing, dress. So there's that. Again, not 100% my style, but I would definitely wear it. It's not something I wouldn't wear. It's just not something I probably would buy for myself. Yeah, this cute little blueberry purse. This is worth $8. That's it there. Little coin purse. I've got a friend who just lives in coin purses, so... Yeah, and they're handy if you're going somewhere. You just want to put, like, a card in and some loose money. The next thing is from Urban Ritual. This and you get a exclusive 20% off coupon. And it is a lip balm. There was these retail at $10 each. There was a variety of um, flavours. I got the guava flavour. I would have loved the milkshake flavour, but and it does smell have a slight guava scent. It is very um this is very moisturizing actually. And this one's saying that it for a, gives you a little tip to make your lips look plumper. Apply a little bit of this on your cupid's bow and at the bottom of the centre of your lower lip for a more enhanced pout. I thought it was quite nice. It was, you know, it's, it's a lip balm, but you can't go wrong with a lip balm. Moving on. The next thing I got, the rest of the box is a little bit disappointing. Actually, I was a little bit disappointed this month. Um, I got here a scrub. This is in coffee. And this is supposed to be a rubbing against cellulite. If you're supposed to be able to rub it against the cellulitic areas, it's supposed to help break down the fat. Um, I haven't used this yet because I wanted to talk to you guys first. But that's the product there. Um, it has that sort of coffee ground feel. 
So there's that one. This is obviously a sample. A full size retails at $21.95 each. So they're not cheap. There's um, three different ones you could have got. We've got a tea one or a pink salt one. The next thing you got is they're really big on going green at the moment. I think a lot of products in this box would have been more suited to their fitness box which they've just released. This to me isn't really beauty based apart from inner health which is important but I think this would have been better for their fitness box personally. Got some green smoothies. I've tried these. These um, retail at $15 and you get five sachets. So you know I've got two sachets here which is fairly good value. Give you an, a chance to taste it. These taste disgusting. I tried one and I nearly vomited. They are gross. Um, I tried it with some banana and orange and yeah it was pretty average. It gives you a little recipe here but not a huge fan. The next thing I got was from Jennifer Jennifer Hawkins has released a tan line. She's released a face tan and a shimmer. Um, the face tan is a full size of 30 mils and retails at $24 which is here. You're supposed to put this onto your face, leave it for hours and you can wash it off and have a, a tanner face. And the um, instant illuminizer is 100 mils and retails at $25. Um, these were, I haven't used these yet obviously, but I've, I've used the um, illuminizer. That it does give you a nice little bit of shimmer there. I haven't tried the face tanner because at the moment I am fairly tan, so I don't really need to go any darker on my face. So that's pretty cool. You got two of the face tan to try and one of the illuminizer. And you also got a 20% 12 off exclusive voucher if you spent over $50. That's pretty cool. And the last thing you got was another health product which would have been better suited to their fitness box. Is a Muesli Life For Me breakfast so a sample of Muesli. This is a custom hair fashion box mix. It's got a naughty and nice base, goji berries, coconut, cranberry, seed mix and chai seeds. And yeah, I'm not a fan of Muesli so I didn't open that. I'll probably give that to my sister. And you got an exclusive 20% off voucher. And that's one. Then the other page, just like people have uh, uploaded pictures and stuff of their own. So let's talk breakdown. You got a, a variety of stuff this month. Was the box worth it this month for me? Probably not. I was really unimpressed with it. Um, in terms of the beauty side of things, there was just it was all health food products, which I'm not a big fan of. If I want to buy something, I'll go down to a local health food store or something along those lines. So a bit disappointing with that, but. Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't. I mean, money monetary wise, if you go by the prices, everything's in there. You have made your money back. Monetary wise, I definitely don't think I made my money back because there's not a lot of products here that I will use. Um, yeah, so I was a bit disappointed this month with her fashion box. Hopefully, the next month will be better. Now they've launched their fitness box. A lot of these maybe fitnessy type products will go into that box and they'll get back to the beauty. And that is my review for Her Fashion Box this month as well. All the links to everything will be down in the description bar below. All right, guys, if you got a Her Fashion Box. Were you impressed? Were you not impressed? Let me know in the comment section. Alright guys, I'll talk to you soon. Bye.